Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Questions and Answers for Trivia Quiz. Today's question is Who was the messenger of the gods in Greek mythology? Greek mythology is a fascinating realm filled with gods, goddesses, and other divine beings. Let's explore some of the most significant figures, including the messenger of the gods. 1. Zeus, the king of the gods, ruler of Mount Olympus, and wielder of thunderbolts. Zeus presides over the sky, lightning, justice, and order. His symbols include the thunderbolt, eagle, and oak tree. He is often depicted with a regal beard and a powerful presence. 2. Poseidon, the god of the seas, earthquakes, and horses. Poseidon wields a trident and is associated with oceanic power. Sailors and seafarers seek his favor for safe voyages. His symbols include dolphins, horses, and sea creatures. 3. Hades, the ruler of the underworld, where souls go after death. Hades is not often worshipped like other gods, but he plays a crucial role in the cycle of life and death. His symbols include the helmet of invisibility and the cypress tree. 4. Hera, the queen of the gods, wife of Zeus, and protector of marriage. Hera is both powerful and jealous, often punishing Zeus lovers. Her symbols include the peacock, cow, and pomegranate. 5. Athena, the goddess of wisdom, warfare, and crafts. Athena emerged fully grown from Zeus' head. She is associated with strategic warfare, wisdom, and justice. Her symbols include the owl, olive tree, and shield. 6. Apollo, the god of music, arts, healing, and prophecy. Apollo is depicted as a young, athletic man. He is associated with the sun and the lyre. His twin sister is Artemis. 7. Artemis, the virgin goddess of the hunt, wilderness, and the moon. Artemis is Apollo's twin sister. She is often portrayed with a bow and arrow, surrounded by animals. Her sacred deer is well known. 8. Aphrodite, the goddess of beauty, love, and desire. Aphrodite emerged from sea foam and is associated with romantic love. Her symbols include the myrtle, roses, and the scallop shell. 9. Hermes, the messenger of the gods. Hermes, son of Zeus and Maia, wears winged sandals and carries a staff called the Caduceus. He is a trickster, protector of travelers, and guide to the underworld. Hermes is also associated with oratory and commerce. So, in ancient Greek mythology, Hermes is commonly known as the messenger of the gods. He is a multifaceted deity associated with various domains, including communication, travel, commerce, and cunning. Here are some key aspects of Hermes in Greek mythology. 1. Messenger of the Gods. Hermes is primarily known for his role as the messenger of the gods. He served as a mediator between the divine realms, delivering messages and commands from the Olympian gods to other deities, as well as to mortals. 2. God of Travel and Boundaries. Hermes was also considered the god of travel, transitions, and boundaries. He was often depicted as a swift and agile figure, wearing winged sandals and a winged hat, pedazos, symbolizing his ability to move quickly between different realms and across boundaries. 3. God of Commerce and Thievery. Hermes was associated with commerce and trade, reflecting his role in facilitating communication and transactions. Additionally, he was known for his cleverness and was considered the god of thieves, as he was believed to have the ability to outwit others. 4. Psychopomp. Hermes played a crucial role as a psychopomp, guiding the souls of the deceased to the afterlife. In this capacity, he escorted souls to the underworld, particularly in his role as a guide to the realm of Hades. 5. Hermes Trismegistus. In later traditions, especially in Hellenistic and later periods, Hermes became associated with esoteric wisdom and alchemy. The figure known as Hermes Trismegistus was a fusion of the Greek god Hermes and the Egyptian god Thoth, representing a synthesis of knowledge and mysticism. The answer for the question is, Hermes. The messenger of the gods in Greek mythology is Hermes. Hermes is a complex and versatile deity, embodying various aspects of human experience and acting as a bridge between different realms. 
His influence can be seen not only in Greek mythology but also in the broader cultural and philosophical traditions of the ancient Mediterranean world. Thanks for watching.